with some fellow countrymen. Press a button and time stops, providing a memory that will last a lifetime. It's a simple step, steps that had been anything but simple for 17-year-old Vladislav Makarov. It's priceless. I mean, just to see the smile on his face when he started to walk just brought tears to our eyes. And those eyes have seen a lot over the last three months. Weiss and members of the Fairfield United Methodist Church in Ohio brought Vladislav here from Russia, where a train accident just outside of Moscow in 2003 took both his legs from the knees down. During rehab, it did not take long for Vlad to learn that a couple of his fellow countrymen were in nearby Pittsburgh. So when an opportunity to meet the Penguins became a reality, a hat trick of smiles was the result. I'm very happy in, uh, in the United States, especially in Pittsburgh. Uh, all the doctors, uh, they, can, uh, they can do something and he would be able to walk again. And for me to put smile on, on his face, it's, it's great. It's very important. Um, I make someone happy today. It makes you very happy and makes you appreciate things more in your life because you can see how one guy is uh, going through a tough time and, you know, you can see how happy he is just, you know, to be at the hockey game and, you know, and just to have a chance to see a player. A game in which Gonchar and Malkin combined for five points in a 7-1 win over Philadelphia. An added bonus for a fan who already felt he was a winner long before he took his seat at Mellon Arena. He couldn't wait to get here. He had a really great time. He said this was the best game that he's ever seen. <laughs> yeah. Up here. Yeah. Press a button and time stops. Perfect. Yes, Vlad has taken that step many times during his stay in America, which in turn will paint a very pretty picture for his friends when he returns to Russia. And while those pictures will say a lot about his visit, Vlad simply says it better. It makes me feel happy. 